Hi, I'm Gretchen Massey outside the Big Brother house, standing here with April, one of the many explosive and expressive players this season, <laughs> also our only showman. Yeah, that's correct. How do you feel right now? Um, I'm excited, a little nervous, of, you know, obviously going out into the real world. Um, excited to see my families and also a little sad. You know, I'm going to miss all these people a lot, so. Will you really miss? Who will you actually miss out of this cast? I um, mean, for real. <laughs> I don't know what they all showed of me, but, um, you know, of course I'm going to miss Michelle. Um, I'm going to miss Jerry. Um, you know, I'm going to I'm already missed Jesse. Jesse is a great guy, too. So, again, I, I'm going to take a little piece of all these people home with me, and I'm going to miss something about every one of them. Are you officially somebody's girlfriend? I am officially Ollie's girlfriend. <laughs> yes, America. I said yes. I said yes. Uh, good. I'm yes. happy to hear that. I'm very excited. So now that we know that's official yes. and the show is over, yes. can you just answer me a scandalous question? <laughs> April, did you guys have relations in the Big Brother house? Because I think I saw it, and I'm not saying it was bad. We liked watching, but did it happen? Um, again, you know, it's hard to comment on it because I don't know what, exactly what you're referring to. I have been unable to yes. see the tapes. <laughs> Is what I'm referring to. <laughs> now you can also you don't have to answer my question. Right. Um, you question. know what? I, again, you know, it's it's difficult to it, it is very difficult to answer that question. But you know, we, we definitely have a relationship um, inside the house. We had a true relationship. It it wasn't just a showman or anything like that. It's going to be a relationship that we take further beyond this game. Um, so you know, it's difficult to comment on something like that because people don't want to share that part of their lives. Well, and you know what? Ollie said the same thing in terms of um, in terms of it not being a showman. He was. Yeah really clear about that when he first came out of the house and we interviewed him yes. and so I'm happy to see that it's reciprocated for him definitely. I would hate for you to have said no yes I would so definitely a showman no 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 absolutely not you know and um, again I, the, I adore the guy to death and I'm just very very excited that I actually found somebody and I don't know if it's destiny or whatever that brought me to this game but again if I can take something out of it it's definitely that relationship with him what do you think about this America's player for one week were you shocked when you discovered that you know what no we no. all thought Dan had some part to do with America's player I mean I mean, obviously, if you've seen the tapes, we all commented on it all the time that Dan had something to do with America's player, maybe the mole, something. He he has some weird tendencies, and that's why we called him out during the roundtable and said, are you really that weird of a person? Um, but that ma that's what makes Dan Dan. You know, I'm so glad he was part of this experience with me because I laughed so many times at Dan because he's, he's a funny character. What did you think about the earthquake? Real or um, fake? Fake, definitely. I definitely thought the earthquake was fake. Again, me being a Nebraska girl coming, you know, I've been through tornadoes and such, but mm. the earthquake I definitely thought was fake. Um, we all did. I think about 85% of us thought it was fake. Wow. Um, there was only a couple that thought it was real, and a lot of them were from California, so they knew and they were standing on the ground that obviously there was a pool. They, for them to move and shift right. the ground is going to be difficult, but we went through every scenario and we're like, no, it's definitely fake, because obviously the competition that was the following day with the, with the earthquake. Yeah, it was perfect. Yeah. Uh, okay, now is there anything at all that you did during the game that you regret now in hindsight, did or said? Oh, I'm sure there's a lot of things I'm going to watch the tapes and regret that I said. You know, I, uh, you know, like I've told people in the past, too, is that when you're in that moment, you don't know, you know exactly what's going on. If you're the public watching it, sometimes they might only catch one side of the story, so you might look like the villain and the other one looks like the saint, and that might not be anything to do with what the actual real story is. So as far as me personally, I definitely regret some of the things that I've stated to some of the people in the house, you know, by saying, you know, Libra was a bad mother in the, in the heat of a moment of a fight. I definitely regret that. I apologize to her sincerely, um, you know, but I, I, I can only just apologize to them, you know, which I've done to every one of them. And I'm sure that they're, you know, we've, they've reciprocated and apologized to me as well. Yeah, it's an intense experience. It's very intense. A few of you get to share. <laughs> so would you come back for an All-Stars? Of course, I would definitely be there for an All-Stars. All right. <laughs> Thank definitely. you, Thank April. you, Gretchen. Enjoy your night. Thank Outside you. Big Brother House, I'm here with a lovely April for CBS.com.